Hello and welcome to another episode of The Zoo. Today we're going to talk about Control M9, the latest and greatest from BMC software. And here to make me understand what it brings to our audience is Robbie, all the way from Chicago. Welcome to The Zoo, Robbie. Hey, Alf. It's great, as always, to be here. And we absolutely will make you understand in a few minutes. You betcha. Thank you. And in Israel is Tom. Welcome, Tom. Hi, Alf. Hi, Robbie. Hi, everybody. Thank you for hosting us. Tell me, in a short, sweet way, what's new in Control M9? Well, there's tons of stuff in Control M9, but just on, you know, just to start with, there is some features related to um, high availability, new high availability mechanism. There is a new way to automatically deploy Control M agents and clients. There is global calendars. There is a promotion between environments. There's tons of features that we've added. And I don't think we have enough time to talk about all of them today, so we'll just mention a few. We've been investing quite a lot of time in this uh, in this release, and we are very very excited to launch it. Yeah. What does what, what do you like the best about the new nine, Robbie? You know, for me, there are some amazing, very powerful features for kind of more on the administrative side, as Tom mentioned. But for me, it's as much about some of what. Uh, or maybe smaller features, but th they're very big for time savings for the users. Things like bookmarks. So uh, it's a pretty common concept in any modern web browser. If you go to you know the same pages over and over, you can bookmark it. There's now that capability for jobs in multiple domains in the control environment. So if you're looking to make a change to the same sort of job every week, or you're looking to see how the on Monday jobs ran uh, on Sunday or over the weekend, you can set up bookmarks now. So it takes like eight seconds to create it, and then every time going forward, you can find that job in probably less than a second. So that's just one of what really are dozens of smaller features that are going to provide massive time savings for users of the Control M solution. So those are my favorite. Uh, it's they're just great. And there's is there some kind of uh, improved design tool there, almost a drag and drop thing to 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 build these type of jobs and scheduling. Yes, you know, so now it's much easier to define jobs as b than before. I mean, we've made a lot, a lot of, an, of uh, improvements in Control M version 8, and now we've made it even simpler to create uh, dependencies between jobs and to share data between jobs in a way that doesn't require you to use any command and utilities and um, allows you to share data, such as, just as an example, if you need to... Um, query the database and determine how many transactions you need to process. So you can now do that and then share the, uh, the number with the rest of the jobs in the, in the workflow very, very easily without any coding all built in into the product. So what's the major benefit to our customers if they upgrade to Control9? So Robbie mentioned the um, reduced TCO, the fact that you can do things a lot, a lot easier. For example, even uh, upgrading the product and administrating it. So now uh, there is an automatic mechanism to um, to up upgrade the agents and upgrade clients in a way that doesn't require you to go to the actual machines or to look into them. And that can be can, that can be a huge time savers for companies that have thousands of agents, and we have banks like that, and uh, and uh, companies in every industry that you can think of that have thousands of uh, components, control and components that needs to be administrated. Um, the fact that uh, that now you can maintain the product in a highly environment, highly available environment, um, in a much much more simple uh, way. So during the installation, everything is configured out of the box and you manage everything from a single point of control. Um, if you are a retail, for example, and you have um, uh, a lot of control and server components, now you can have one calendar synced automatically to all the server components uh, without the need to uh, manually update each one of the environments uh, separately. And of course, as Robbie said before, the promotion between environment and the features that allow users to schedule the product much, much easier than before. Um, there is a auto, there is a, um, uh, new analytics capabilities. So now you have um, um, instant visibility into the um, uh, estimated start time of end time of jobs, even without modeling those to business batch business services. Mm -hmm. uh, so that's huge benefit out of the box, without you know without the need to do anything to configure anything 
after you install the product. And there is a lot, a lot more. This is just the start. <laughs> we can spend here hours just talking about those features. I can imagine. And this, this runs across multiple different platforms, and from open source to proprietary stuff. Absolutely. It, uh, you know, as always, Control M's been supported and able to run on more platforms than anyone, and that list continues to grow. And if you look at something like Application Integrator, it's not even really specific to version nine. Uh, Tom talked a little bit about some of its features, but came out a couple months ago. But if you, if anybody's going to nine, uh, whether they're new, uh, net new to Control M or upgrading to it, and they implement Application Integrator, now they can have basically custom, excellent support, uh, right almost literally out of the box with Control M with absolutely any application or platform uh, with uh, the ability uh, for the ops folks to get with the uh, the devs folks to create you know maybe a custom integration with Control M and a, and a homegrown solution they have or maybe something off the shelf that you know we don't have a specific integration for today they can use application integrator to get that application and uh, net new application into the environment or changes to existing applications faster than ever before it's just uh, and that again that's not even net new to version 9 but it came out a couple months ago anybody going to 9 uh, uh, likely will have the availability for application integrator as well and Tom mentioned retail. Are there any specific industry-specific industry use cases that you can sort of use to illustrate how Control 9 is bringing value to businesses? So one that I can think of off the top uh, at uh, one of our larger retail customers that had an early look at version 9 and specifically the feature Tom talked about where you can do a, a automated upgrade on a, a what, a massive number of agents if you like control M touches a lot of machines and environment especially a large retail environment where they've got a few thousand uh, control M agents uh, takes quite a bit of heavy lifting to get all of those upgraded and so there was tools that were built in to help make that easier but as of version 9 and the uh, the uh, client or and or the agent upgrade capabilities they tested it a little bit in the in the pre uh, GA version and said that it might allow them to go from a months long upgrade cycle to a days long upgrade cycle across their thousands of agents and I mean they were giddy with that feature alone uh, in version 9 yeah, that sounds nice. yeah. Yeah. we had some banks that uh, told us the same exact story about the number of agents and they said they had you know full uh, full-time employee working just on upgrading the control M components across the, across the board because they have so many components to upgrade. So full-time employee that now can do things much, much faster and can be allocated to other tasks. I love it. I like when technology is helping us the people rather than when people help technology, which seems to be the case <laughs> too many times. But, well, thanks, guys. I really appreciate you coming into the zoo and helping me understand what Control M9 has to offer, and hopefully we can do this soon again. Thank you very much, Alf. Thanks, Alf. Awesome as always. For the rest of you out there, take care. Be safe. Bye-bye.